Tennessee is in the driver's seat in the Knoxville Regional with a 3 0 win. Kellyanne Stitz has more on how Ashley Rogers found herself again in the circle. After one of her eight strikeouts against Oregon State, Lady Vols ace Ashley Rogers could be seen strutting out of the circle, and that energy is a product of her embracing imperfections. While Rogers had a near perfect game this afternoon, her journey this season has been anything but perfect. Rogers had to overcome injury and be patient with the recovery process, working her way back to be able to play championship softball. Rogers had to learn how to embrace the imperfect journey she has been dealt and is reaping the reward of dealing in the postseason. It's okay to not be perfect. And I think this year she realized I don't have a choice and I just have to um, embrace some things that are a little bit different in how I go about things with my practices and how I manage things in the game. And I couldn't be more proud of her. I mean, it's no secret this year has been really tough for me, um, just health wise. And even that was really tough mentally to go through. Um, and just the support that I've had from this team and the coach, co coaching staff through this process has been um, something I'm forever grateful for. And they just encouraged me to just go out there and be myself no matter what. Rogers tossed a complete game and a near no hitter, only giving up two hits on 88 total pitches to pick up her 12th win of the season and shut out. The Beavers to move on to the regional finals. As for who will start in the circle tomorrow, head coach Karen Weekly said she is waiting to see how the afternoon games go to make that decision. For WAT Sports, I'm Kellyanne Stitz.